Hello guys, me Carlos Santos a Capricorn I5 and I'm gonna do a video that I do not want to do but it's really a little bit bad but I have to announce it. Kyle Larson, he's gonna lose his crew chief, his drag man, and his front tire trainer for I believe one month. So I was on my smartphone listening to it from the PR and radio team and this and that and that's <coughs> sorry I think I heard that they said that Carl Larson lost a tire I believe when he was going uphill in turn one just right bef right after he left the in the exit of pit road I mean it's one of those things when when you think you have the lug nuts tight, I mean, it's only one lug nut, but there's nothing you can do once you tell the driver, hey, you gotta slow down, but, or for the crew to say, hey, slow down and be sure the lug nuts are tight. Mm -hmm. We all learned from the Denny Hamlin incident at Dover that it's not easy to get the air wrenches or the air gun and make that that lug nut tight. So I mean that has to be disappointing, but I think Kyle Larson. Yeah, you gotta be positive throughout these four weeks, including the off week, you know, and Cliff Danger's gonna lose time. And so, what else do I wanna say about the four week suspension thing? Oh, I can't wait until Larry McReynolds from NASCAR on Fox analyzes it and said, Hey, I know Dan Cliff Daniels was very vocal about these air guns, not, you know, rotating the lug nuts that tight, that the spindles inside those wheels, you know, they have to be precise and to the point that even if you got them tight, you're still going to have... A loose wheel in some shape or form but the thing is it can vibrate too much or else you'll lose it so and I've and I'm a very loyal Kyle Larson fan and all I can say is if you're in my Kyle Larson is the real deal Facebook page we as a group, we're going to be a close-knit group. We're going to pray that these four weeks will be okay, even though Kyle Larson's in the playoffs. And it's not until September when it begins. So. I know this piece wasn't what I hoped for, but yeah, I wanted to keep it as limited as possible. So I don't go overboard and overreact to Karl Larson's first few weeks of losing a head coach in his ear, telling him, you're doing all right on the track. We're going to have the pit crew, you know, do certain things to the car that will make it better. So, but hey, they have backup trackmans, crew chiefs. Front tire changers. Hendrick Motorsports has the best staff in all of motorsports or, or in NASCAR. So, <laughs> yep. Keep your chin up, Carl. And hopefully, those four weeks will fly by and many race fans will say, hey, it just never happens. So, I may have a Carl 5 Y'all have a great day. Peace out.